When you start working as a freelancer, you need to understand your wits about collaboration tools because you're going to collaborate with not just your clients, but also other designers, developers, marketing teams, and so much more. So in this video, I'm going to show you some awesome collaboration tools and what you need to learn about them. Hey designer, Alex here, welcome to the channel and before we move on with today's video, make sure to check out my membership, a link is going to be down in the description below. Membership includes all of my courses, digital design products, private access to the Facebook group, practice files for my YouTube tutorials and live streams and so much more. So if you're interested in content like that, make sure to check it out once again, a link is going to be down in the description below. The first tool I'm going to mention is Miro and before I move on any further, links to all of these websites I'm going to mention in this video are going to be linked down in the description below. If you want to check them out, make sure to head over there, click and it's going to show you all of these websites. So as I said, first things first, we have Miro and we have Miro, it says where teams get work done. Basically how this works is you can see right here, all of the teammates which are included in a, a team can access all of these different templates or create separate templates and work together on a project. So let's say that you are a UI UX designer and your the part of the process is the UX work, let's say, and you need to fit into the overall company structure and their own schedule. So if you're doing, for example, UX research, how long that research is going to take and how it fits into the structure of the company and in the structure of the team. So for example, maybe you need to work with some teammates on other parts of the process uh, during your UX research process. So you're going to put that there. And if you need feedback from your teammates, which most likely you will have, then you need to understand how to get that feedback, how to put it in your work and back in your work and how to structure it inside of the company uh, mapping and planning and all sorts of different things. So make sure to explore it. All of these are going to be paid products, but nevertheless, they all have some free um, trial period and you can sign up for free on a bunch of them and try it for free just to understand what it is and some capabilities it offers because some teams out there are working inside of these uh, products. And if you get to be the part of that team, if you jump inside, make sure to familiarize yourself with these tools to be able to communicate with that team on that particular project. So as I said, myro.com, make sure to check it out. Next up, we have Milanote and it says get organized, stay creative. Basically, it works just like a giant Pinterest board. You can pin everything there. You can comment everything there for inspiration, for uh, UX process, for UI process, for example, for um, different directions in design, for color changes. You can put color palettes right here. You can invite other teammates. They can give you feedback. Uh, you can remove, you can add more stuff. You can put stuff on top of each other, like you can see with this color card right here. Uh, if somebody else in your team is, for example, adjusting uh, the work that you already done, then you can provide feedback back to them and you can put these in uh, stages. For example, this is the planning stage that you see on your screen. Maybe we are going to move on to the next stage where we're going to include some imagery, but what type of imagery we are going to include. Perhaps we are going to have a few different options, maybe some with the darker backgrounds, maybe some with the lighter backgrounds, and you can get feedback from your teammates on that imagery before you actually put it in your design. So Milanote, make sure to check it out. They also have a free plan, explore it, see some functionality, see some possibilities, what they have to offer. So if you encounter a team further down the line, which is using Milanote, you are familiar with it. Next up, we have markup.io. You can sign up for free and you can get started for free, but of course it's a paid tool. So what it is, uh, you can get website feedback, you can get image feedback, PDF feedback and video feedback. So whatever you put on this page, much like all of these other ones, which I already mentioned, you can get feedback and you can get it done. You can then attach attachments to that feedback 
to uh, further explore that feedback and move it along you can update your images your websites your links your videos all of the content on these pages and then you can move along and get some additional feedback new feedback you can get back to the old feedback see what people said in the previous revisions and then you can go back there and you can apply the feedback moving along further so once again markup.io check it out create your free account and explore it see what it can do for you next up we have dittoworlds.com it's a single source of truth for your product copy so this is for your copy if you're writing a copy if you have a copywriter and you want to be involved in that process then you can get it done using this tool make sure to get started uh, with the free plan to familiarize yourself what it can do and how it can help you they have some great video tutorials right here at the end uh, source of true so from draft to design to review to production a single place to manage the copy in all of its stages so let's say that you have a blog website and you want to understand which sort of copy should you include in a home page which sort of copy should you include in the about page in the contact us page and in the blog pages themselves then you can get in touch with these copywriters who are working in this company that you are working on and then you can collaborate together on for example let's say that the titles are not too good maybe they don't convert so well maybe they don't work on the responsive design maybe they are not prominent enough so your involvement in this team is going to be crucial in order for them to do their job the best they could or if you are a copywriter yourself and then you can use this tool uh, with your clients to get some additional feedback on the copywriting you can deliver faster for so you can see writing editing design development you can copy and paste this copy in your design especially if you're using adobe xd so dearworlds.com make sure to check it out and explore it for yourself and finally we have usebubbles.com less meeting more work done collaborate using screen video and audio messages so you can work on your own time no account or installation needed which is great so you can see get bubbles free forever or you can add it to chrome and you can basically start the recording session and you can apply feedback to whichever stage of the design process you are in so for example if you're working on exploration maybe some paper wireframes or some wireframes in adobe xd for example then you can record the video you can invite collaborators in and then you can hit start recording everybody can provide their feedback you can walk them through kind of like i'm doing right now maybe create some sort of a design tutorial of your own faces don't have to be shown just video is going to work just fine and you can see on your right hand side right here they are providing feedback and then you can get that feedback uh, to yourself you can apply it to that design and you can make some additional changes so you can discuss topics uh, schedule meetings start conversations immediately and get back to doing the real work so basically what this is is kind of like google meets just for design you can invite people in they can bring feedback to the table they can provide feedback that you can collaborate in real time and then you get the recording which you can play in your own time to apply those changes so once again use bubbles.com check it out it's free as you can see so there you go those are the resources for today's video i really hope you liked them make sure to check them out links are going to be down in the description below thank you so much for watching this video if you liked it make sure to press the like button make sure to subscribe to the channel i upload new videos every single week all about ui ux design adobe xd passive income techniques resources just like these ones and so much more so if you're interested in content like that make sure to subscribe thank you so much for watching this one and until next time take care